It is possible for family-friendly restaurants to please both parents and kids. And here in St. Louis, we have three top picks for you to explore. Fitz has started in St. Louis in 1947. Its claim to fame was hamburgers and its own root beer. The owner of the company was a Mr. Fitzpatrick, and he did that for quite some time. It eventually closed. And we were able to track down the original Fitz's root beer recipe. We discovered it was, you know, just a phenomenal root beer. And we thought it would be really cool and unique to do a microbrewery for soda. We found the right place to do that, which is here in the Del Mar Loop, and we opened here in February 1993. For our business, it's been really cool because a lot of families like to come and explore the Loop. We have the Walk of Fame here, Loop Trolley, which is new this year, which families love, so there's plenty of things to do. At Fitz's, we have a classic American menu, food ranging from burgers to fish and chips. We're famous for pickle chips. We smoke our own meat, and we serve it with Fitz's root beer barbecue sauce. Our floats are gigantic, and they've evolved in a way where people come in and can make a meal of them if that's what they want to do. Almost everybody that comes into Fitz's who has a bottomless mug of soda always gets the root beer. But a lot of the fruit flavors, you know, kids go for. I tell people I've consumed more root beer than anybody who's ever lived because I have the great job of being able to taste every batch. And it's made right here. I think that's all part of why people enjoy coming to Fitz's. Here at Grace Meeting 3, our best hope is that people will walk in and feel like part of our family. It's like family food, you know? What you would have a big family around a large table sharing food that they grew up eating or that their grandparents ate. The Grove area was like super exciting for us because of the neighborhood community around it. The people that are really eager to support the Grove, all the small businesses in the Grove. We're country, you know, Midwestern comfort food. Garlic whipped mashed potatoes, slow cooked collard greens with ham hocks, marinated beets, mac and cheese. The most popular menu item that we have hands down is our fried chicken. We try to use a lot of stuff from local purveyors and local farms and try to just keep it fresh. You always have your kind of staple flagship items, but then we also get seasonal vegetables and prepare them like a little different sort of way. You could get like a whole bird, a slab of ribs, and a family style bowl of mashed potatoes, collard greens, you know, mac and cheese, whatever you want, and just kind of mill around with a large family. You know, it's kind of perfect for that. We're located in the Del Mar Loop across the street from the pageant and next to Pie Pizzeria. We named it the Baked Bear. It's a franchise based in San Diego. We bake the cookies fresh every day, hence the baked, and then the bear is the polar bear because we use the ice cream for the ice cream sandwiches. First you pick your cookie or your brownie. We've got 12 different options of those. We have chocolate chip, cookies and cream, a snickerdoodle, a funfetti, which is sprinkles, the town favorite, the gooey butter. We also have like a red velvet, we have an M&M, and our peanut butter. We do a cookie of the month also, so every month there's a rotating one. We also have 13 different ice creams that we do. You got toasted s'mores, a birthday cake with a ton of sprinkles. Our signature one is called Bear Batter, so it's a blue ice cream. It's cake batter with fudge and brownies mixed in, so everybody goes crazy over that one. So then you pick your cookies and your ice cream, and then you go to the toppings, and you pick your topping. So we wrap it around the outside of the ice cream sandwich, or you can do like hot fudge, caramel, or whipped cream that'll go on top. There's so many options. You can mix and match your ice cream sandwich, and everybody feels like a kid again. <laughs>